Most Mosley customers uh, use the product specifically because they can use the cloud as a, as a vault. And that vault uh, allows them to not have to worry about growing and, and implementing an on-premise uh, storage solution to store backup data. Uh, and, and that ha certainly has its benefits. Uh, and again, most of the Mosey environments uh, tend to be Windows uh, heavy or Windows centric anyways. And, and that's fine. Uh, but the problem is, as you start to look at the enterprise, the enterprise really needs more than that. The good news for Mosey customers is that Carbonite recently acquired the company and is shifting um, Mosey customers to Carbonite Server. Now, Carbonite Server brings several key advantages, uh, actually lots of key advantages, several that we'll key in on right now. That probably the big one that jumps out to uh, an existing Mosey customer is going to be the fact that now there's an on-premise component that is in between the cloud and the servers that are being protected. That on-premise component uh, hosts the software and also uh, provides some storage capacity. That storage capacity is then allows us to route backups directly to it first, then replicate data to the cloud. Actually, it kind of happens in parallel. And then what that gives us now is the ability to recover uh, much more quickly in the most normal recovery circumstance. If you think about it, you're not declaring a disaster every day, right? You are actually uh, probably just recurring, recovering a set of files or maybe uh, databases, things of that nature. Uh, so this allows you to uh, use this on-prem component to be able to facilitate those type of restores. And anytime we don't have to make a hop to the cloud, that's gonna allow for a much, much faster recovery effort. Now, the other big difference for the Mosey customer as you shift to Carbonite Server is going to be an increased number of platform support, making it much more enterprise class. Uh, the Carbonite solution actually supports over 200 different platforms and applications, uh, even including some things that uh, would be uh, considered legacy uh, by today's standards, but certainly still exist in many, many enterprise data centers. Uh, that would include uh, AIX, Solaris, and IBM iSeries. So uh, that kind of coverage is really going to allow you to standardize on one solution and really make it a much better fit for the enterprise client. Now the other thing I like about the on-premise appliance is I don't need to have 100% of my data here and 100% of my data in the cloud. One of the things that we can do is set policies here to, for example, only um, keep a certain number of days backups on-prem. Because uh, again, you're going to use this appliance most of the time to facilitate the immediate restore, which is almost always going to come from last night's backup. The other big gain in the Mosey to Carbonite server transition is going to be able to use this vault for more than just vaulting, or able to use a cloud for more than just vaulting. And that includes now disaster recovery. With Carbonite server, you can optionally select some mission critical servers and get a uh, push button recovery in the cloud capability. So in the event that a disaster happens, because, uh, you know, like I said, disasters don't happen every day, but when they do, the, the scope of it is, is really critical, and so being able to recover uh, in those situations becomes very important. Uh, this push button recovery is perfect for disaster recovery, because in a disaster, you don't have time, you know, things are falling around around you, you probably have personal things going on, so the simpler we can make the disaster recovery effort, the better, so the fact that we can get it down to, you know, literally a single push to start uh, servers and appliances and things like that in the cloud is a huge gain. The other big advantage there is this eliminates the need for the organization to go invest into its own DR site. The problem with doing that, of course, is you have to obviously own the equipment or, or set up a, with a, a hosting provider or something like that or a colo. Uh, the other issue there is, is testing and getting people there. So all of that goes away, and with this push button recovery, now we just leverage the Carbonite Cloud to uh, instantiate uh, critical recoveries of mission critical systems. So for Mosey customers, the transition to a Carbonite server makes a lot of sense. You pick up a much broader platform coverage. You also pick up a really critical feature uh, in cloud recovery. 
And then you also pick up the ability to facilitate uh, on-prem, fast on-prem recovery uh, capabilities. So it, it's a real gain, I think, for the typical Mosey customer and certainly something that they should look at. I'm George Crump, Lead Analyst for Storage Switzerland.